Hi, I'm Dr. Alan Widener from MassageChairRelief.com, and today is our uh, bi-weekly massage chair industry update for Tuesday, August 19th, 2014. And, uh, you know, it's almost the end of summer. I cannot believe where the summer's gone. Our next uh, industry update won't be until uh, September, but uh, I hope you've had a good summer. We had a great summer, of course, with the kids and the grandkids. It makes it lots of fun. But uh, anyways, the year is going fast, and the older I get, the faster time goes, the faster my hair recedes, the faster the hair grows on my ears and my nose, and on my eyebrows, and uh, the faster uh, I gain weight in areas that I never used to gain weight in. Uh, but anyways, uh, it is uh, it is uh, the end of summer, and I hope we've had a good good summer. Well, as far as the massage chair business goes, uh, stock is pretty good across the board. It is the season of uh, of, of it's summer is not a heavy buying season for massage chairs, but uh, it is. A, it seems to have been a good season for new models with Inata coming out with their Dreamwave and with the Flex 3S and with Human Touch coming out with their AccuTouch 8.0 and the Whole Body 5.1 and, and Panasonic coming out with the, the MA73. So it's been a good season for a lot of new models and I suspect we'll be seeing more models before before the Christmas season hits. But uh, the stock is good right now. And Infinite Therapeutics, by the way, announced this last week that they are bringing back the black. Uh, interior color on the Iyashi chair. Now the Iyashi chair is that modern looking one. It's got a white exterior, a hard plastic white exterior, and it is a uh, it's a very contemporary, progressive looking chair, but a great chair. It's got the butt rollers, you know, the extended roller track that goes down to the buttocks. It's got the uh, uh, it's got the uh, slide away, you know, sliding base away from the wall, so you can put the chair right up against the wall, and uh, but you know a bunch of other great features. Nice chair, but they only had two colors. They had the they had the cherry red interior color. And the caramel brown interior color, which is kind of like an orangey brown, leathery looking color. Well, they they introduced a black <clears throat> about a year ago, but it was only temporary, and it was quite a popular color while we were selling it. But the black uh, Iyashi was discontinued, and now they brought it back. And I asked Mike over there at Infinite Therapeutics if this is a permanent thing or if this is temporary, and he said this is permanent. So the new black the, the new black color is back. Black is back. And, uh, and now again, that is black interior, not black exterior. It's still a white exterior, but the contrast of black to white is really a nice look. We put the new photos up, uh, images back up on the website, and it's there for your enjoyment and, of course, for your uh, purchase if you decide to purchase. And speaking of purchasing massage chairs, uh, as you may or may not know, massage chair relief, the whole intent of massage chair relief, yes, it's to sell massage chairs, but it's to be a resource for people who are looking for massage chairs. So it's very difficult to make a decision on a chair. We, all you've done is looked online, read the feature set, looked at the pictures, and tried to compare it to other chairs. <clears throat> it's difficult to make a decision. And sometimes you get a chair and you go, well, that's not at all what I was expecting, or that's not at all like my Uncle Frank or Aunt Mary's uh, chair. Uh, I was uh, hoping it would be like that. But every chair, every manufacturer, every model is different, and the feel is different, and the experience is different. But unless you can sit on it, which is difficult at times, uh, because there, there's not a lot of places where you can try out all the massage chairs, uh, the best, the next best thing is to have this data online. And, and our website is designed to be that data uh, source for you so that you have as much information as possible to make an educated decision. Well, we've added uh, two new resources for you. One is is our book, The Ultimate Massage Chair Buyer's Guide, which I've told you about in previous uh, previous uh, industry updates. Well, that book is now on Amazon as a Kindle download uh, or as a paperback a hard copy book. Well, the Kindle download is $2.99. The paperback book is $8.99. But the $2.99 Kindle download is free and has been free since last Saturday up until tomorrow, Wednesday, the 20th at midnight. So... If you want to get the book, go ahead and download it. It's free on Kindle right now until the end of the day tomorrow at midnight. And it's a great book. It's 221 pages. You can tell from the thickness of it. It's not just a little tiny report. It's a full-fledged full, full -fledged book. Uh, it's got uh, 10 different chapters in there. It's got a great appendix, which includes a, a whole bunch of articles that I wrote and that have been on my blog and article library in the past. Glossary, uh, a re, a massage chair resources. It would basically cover every topic that I've been asked about in my 10 years in the industry uh, and, and even some things that I haven't been asked about but I feel are important for you to know. So go ahead and download the book on Kindle. Uh, just go to Amazon.com, type in Massage Chair Buyer's Guide, and both the options will come up. Click the Kindle, download it. And if you don't have a Kindle, that's okay because you can get a Kindle Reader app on your phone or on your tablet or 
computer and then you can just buy the buy the or download the the, the kindle uh, or the kindle version and then open it on your reader on whatever your device is so you can read it it's pretty cool anyways that's one resource the, the, the book and uh and then the second resource is another playlist that we've put up on our youtube channel our youtube channel's got over 250 videos and and counting each and every week uh so anyways we've got we put up a new playlist and the playlist is massage chair relief customer interviews and these interviews are great. We've got two of them up so far. We should have about four or five, but my, my computer broke down two weeks ago. The webcam wouldn't work. The thing fritzed out. The computer guy couldn't fix it. So we've moved everything over to a new laptop, new camera. The, 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 this picture might look a little different because we're using a different a different webcam. But uh, bottom line is it's taken me a while to, to get some more uh, uh, interviews done. But we've got uh, we've got two up right now, and Sarah... And Brandon were up uh, a couple, three weeks ago. And then last week we put up Isaac Garcia, who's a customer that we have in Texas. And he bought an OS 4000 and he shares his experience. It was a great interview. And it's kind of cool. These interviews are cool because uh, I get to ask questions about their experience and they get to share their experience and how they decide on the chair they got, what they like about it, what their experience was looking for a chair and buying a chair through us or any other retailer that they may have uh, perused. But it's a great, uh, uh, fairly objective. I mean, it's 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 not objective in the fact that they're my customers. I get that. But it's objective in the fact that it's not me telling you about a chair or about an experience of buying a chair. It's them and their real life experience. It's cool stuff. Uh, tomorrow or, or the next day, we'll be putting up a, an interview with Mimi McDaniel. It's a two part one because it was a 20 minute interview. And, it, and I we had to edit it and cut it in half and uh, uh, put it, make it into a two part interview. But uh Mimi talks about her chair, and so you'll get to watch that too. But as, e as with each succeeding interview, we will post them to the playlist. And if you are a, a subscriber to our YouTube channel, you will be notified whenever we post a new video, whether it's a, a, a customer interview, whether it's a massage chair industry update, whether it's a, a chair uh, feature review, or whether it's a massage chair industry uh, interview with one of the heads of the industry, or uh, or whatever you know whatever it is uh, you know feel free to uh, feel free to go and check out our YouTube channel but go watch the custom interviews I think you'll find them very helpful especially if you're still in the process of looking for a massage chair so those are the two resources we just have uh, recently added so hopefully you'll find those those beneficial uh, we changed our Facebook Twitter and Google Plus pages to kind of look all the same same colors same images. And it looks nice. I hired a company to do it because I don't know what I'm doing. And uh, to be quite frank with you, I, I was the one that put most of it together. And it, it was kind of a mess. And you don't realize it's a mess until someone comes along and says, that's a mess. And you go, it is a mess. You know, you kind of stand back and you go, yeah, it is. You know, I kind of got used to it. It's kind of like, uh, it's kind of like, you know, I was just thinking of my kids. I try to tie everything into my kids, I guess. But, uh, you know, uh, I'll go into my kid's room and it's a mess. But I, I, and I tell them to clean it. They don't clean it. Or, or like my son, my 16-year-old, he's got his job is to clean the bathroom upstairs. Well, I tell him to clean the bathroom, he cleans it, but when I go up there, it still is a mess. So after a while, you just get used to it being a mess. And so you, you, it's almost like your standards drop so much because you're so used to what you saw. And then all of a sudden, a, you know, you got a, fa a visitor show up from out of town, and they got to use the, his bedroom and use his bathroom up there. And all of a sudden, you realize, holy monkey, this place is a pigsty. This is a disaster. This is a mess. And that's kind of how it was with my Facebook and Twitter <laughs> and Google Plus pages, and and these guys have cleaned it up nicely for me. And uh, and uh, we won't we'll be posting uh, on those uh, social media platforms a little bit different. I won't be posting every single video and every single article. Uh, and and, and uh, it, it, maybe it's a little bit overkill. I'm a content guy. I love content. I love writing. I love sharing information. I love recording videos and giving you content so you can make a decision. Well, we're going to kind of be a little bit more discriminating in how much we post and when we post. But anyways, you'll see some changes there if you're if you're used to seeing our Facebook page. And go ahead and uh, like our Facebook page or, or or share our Facebook page or our Google Plus page or our Twitter, or whatever. Uh, we, we, we'd appreciate you helping us uh, spread the word about massage chairs, but also our business. Okay, where was I? We talked about the Yashi, the Kindle download, uh, uh, the, the playlist. Um, another thing is uh, I, I wrote an article. Okay. You probably heard me talk about this a couple of weeks ago when I was talking about uh, comparing the Dreamer, Osaki OS 3D Pro Dreamer to the Inada Dreamwave. And I've got, uh, I had a customer that called and said, which is more intense? I've heard that the Inada Dreamwave is really light and it's too soft. And, I, you know, and, I, and he wanted to compare it to, the, he wanted me to compare it to the Dreamer. And I have both of them in my showroom. So I said, you know what, I'm going to go down to my showroom and I'm going to, because I'm going I'm to check it for sure because, you know, yes, the Sonya by default, or sorry, the Dreamwave used to be called the Sonya, but the new version is just the Dreamwave. The Dreamwave is a pretty gentle, soothing massage by default.
but I know that you can increase the intensity of it. I've done it many times. You increase the 3D rollers, you, you take off the pads, you recline the chair all the way. But I couldn't remember how intense it got until I compared it in the shop uh, with the Dreamer. And you know what? It, it was intense, man. Like that Dreamer, the neck, the upper back, and the mid back, or the, the Dream Wave was more intense than the Dreamer. And the, the Dreamer, though, was more intense on the low back than the Dream Wave was. But I was su surprised by how intense the Dream, dream Wave was. Like it, it was, the gal that works in the back of the office uh, said, I could hear her calling out, are you okay in there? Because I was moaning and groaning, eh? And it was, uh, it was sore. Uh, but I like it that way. I like an intense massage. That's what I like. And so it was cool that I could see that the, the, the dream wave, as gentle as it can be, can also be very, very aggressive. And I love that. But the dreamer, on the other hand, had a fantastic low back intense massage, which I found more intense than the dream wave. Well, anyways, to make a long story even longer, I figured, well, why don't you just write a review of the two chairs? Because they're both very popular chairs. Dreamway is like our, our top selling individual model. But the dreamer is, you know, not far behind. And they kind of had the same word, dream, in them. So I thought, well, shoot, why don't we just compare the two things? So anyways, I started writing a comparison. I wrote part one last Friday, and that, that compared the, the, the differences between the two chairs. Part two will come out uh, today or tomorrow, and that will have the, uh, the similarities between the two chairs. But anyways, check out that blog post uh, for what it's worth. We have tons of articles on our blog. I think it's like 700 articles I've written over the, over the last nine years. And, you know, knock yourselves out. There's a lot of good information there for you to decide what kind of a chair to get. Anyways. And that is it for the blog post uh, of the week to talk about. Uh, and I think that's about it, eh? So if you have any questions or anything you want to chit-chat with me about as far as, uh, as far as massage shares go, feel free to call me, email me. We have a chat feature on our website. Um, uh, you know, I, I'm always available. And, and, and if I can't talk to you on the phone or if I can't get to you right away in an email, I will get back to you. I'll leave a message, uh, you know, uh, whatever. And I, I will get back to you. If whoever answers the phone, uh, you know, says I'm not available right now because I'm with a, another customer on the other line. Leave your name and number. I'll call you back. Uh, and also, if you found this video helpful, please feel free to share it. Like these videos, I just don't put them up here just to hear myself talk. I, I'm kind of sick of hearing myself talk, to be quite frank with you. But I like sharing information that others can share with others to help spread the word about massage shares. Massage shares is a, is, is a fantastic industry, and it's growing, and it's becoming more and more popular in the United States, around the world, let alone the United States. Uh, and, uh, you know, I, I want others to know about it and I want others to know that there's an option for feeling better than having to drive out and go, uh, and go somewhere to get care. You can take care of a lot of your aches and pains in house. And so, uh, and, and, and it makes you feel just fantastic. Eh? And if you're watching hockey or a TV show or a soap or whatever, it feels pretty dang good to sit in a massage while you're watching it. It helps reduce your stress, especially if you're an Edmonton Oiler fan like I am. I feel so much stress when I'm watching hockey. I can't even believe, I can't even describe to you the stress I feel. Well, a massage chair makes that feel a little bit better now, doesn't it? So there you go. It's stress relief while you're watching your team that stinks. Well, anyways, I don't know where I was going with that, but, uh, you know, feel free to spread the word about massage chairs for us. Uh, if you found this video helpful, you know, thumbs up it to here on YouTube or, or share it. But, uh, uh, you know, please help us spread the word. Well, I'm Dr. Alan Widener from MassageChairRelief.com, and I will see you again in two weeks on our